Now, just to illustrate the functionality of the citation tool a bit further, if we didn't have the URL code, but we had a journal article that had a DOI code, for example, this journal article, a knowledge-based search engine powered by Wikipedia, we've got a DOI code down here, where I just highlighted, it's quite small, but I can use that, just copy that link, hold down control and press C to copy it, and then I can use that in the visual editor. So if I hit edit, go down to my citation sections, I add another sentence. I also read an article about a knowledge based search engine. That's where I want my citation to go, so exactly where my cursor is at the end of the line there, and I hit the citation drop down, and this time I'm going to paste in the DOI code, so control V. Now, okay, just make sure there's no spaces, and hit generate. Okay, and there it's found the journal article, and it's formatted the citation for us title, authors, uh, DOI code as well and that's a clickable link as well. So we can hit insert and we see that number two has come up and a second reference has come up. Okay and we can hit save added citation. Save page. Again, the capture code, hazy roughs. Okay, save. Okay, go down. Right, um, one last one. If we don't have a URL or DOI code, you might have a PubMed ID. So if we had an article that we'd wanted to include, if we had an article like this. from PubMed. You'll see down the bottom, bottom left, we have a PubMed ID of double one, double one, double one, double one. So eight ones. We don't need the PMID letters or the colon, we just need the code itself. So hold down control and C. Back to our user page. and we're going to click into the visual editor down to our citation I also read an article about hel helicobacter Okay, use the citation drop down and you'll see that now we have a third tab as well. We have the reuse tab. We can reuse the women spies tab. Uh, we can reuse the women spies citation or we can reuse the knowledge based search engine one. But I'm entering something completely new so I'm going back to automatic and putting in the PubMed ID control V. Equally, I can just type this in and just make sure there's no spaces. So, eight ones, generate. Okay, and it's found the article through the PubMed ID. Author, date, clickable link title, journal that it appeared in, clickable link on the ISSN number, clickable link on the PubMed ID number. Great, insert. And that's 
reference number three. So we've got our three references. Save page. Added citation. Okay, so our page is almost there.